Here we have our iStat device. To power it on, we are going to press this button. We are going to hit two for iStat cartridge, and then we are going to scan our barcode. We are then going to scan our patient. Here's our test patient. And then we are going to scan our cartridge. Our Chem 8 is gonna be our BMP, where our CG4 is going to give us our lactate results. And we're gonna to want to run the lactate first if you have one nice step. So it says insert cartridge. We want to make sure we fill our cartridge with blood before we insert it. So we're going to open our package. Only touching the bottom and the sides, never touching the top or the center. are going to expel a couple of drops, remove the air bubbles, you're going to tilt it to the side, not inside the hole, and you're going to fill it up to the blue. So there it is adequately filled. We are going to pull over that clamp and hear it snap. And then we are going to insert it into the eye stack. As this is our lactate one, we could either press zero and it's going to select all or we can hit one and it's just going to hit the lactate and then we are going to hit the arrow key we're going to hit either in the ICU arterial or venous uh, we are going to put arterial you can see sample type one um, and then it is going to calculate your results here we can see it has resulted with a lactic of 1.71 hit the over button. All right, so you have a scanner enter comment that is for a comment code on the side of every iStat report what the comment codes are. One is error, two is training, three is empty notified. One and two, if we don't want the results to go in the patient's chart, you would select one or two. Three is just that you notified the MD. We will select three and then enter. You can see our lactic of 1.71 here. So you are done with your test, you can remove the test card and you can power it off. When you power it off, that's what sends it to the electronic health record. Here we're going to run a Chem 8. We're going to power it on. iStat cartridge, we're going to hit number 2. Scan our ID. Scan our patient, scan our cartridge. When it says insert cartridge here, we are going to make sure we fill up our cartridge with our patient's blood prior. An identifying cartridge, please wait. It is locked. We are not going to remove our cartridge at this time. Here on the iStat, we're going to select which labs. We can either select individual labs or we can hit zero and we're going to select all of the labs. We are then going to press the over button. We're going to select our sample type, one being arterial, two venous, three other. We'll select arterial. As you can see, it is now calibrating and processing our sample. Here it has beeped, we know it's done. We can see our results, so sodium 126, potassium 30, and so on. We want to hit the page over button so we can see all the results. Glucose 265, we can toggle back and forth between the two. Scanner enter code. Um, as a reminder on the side, there is the comment codes. One is air, two is training, three is MD notified. Airs one and two will not put this information in EPIC, three will. Here, we will go ahead and put a comment code of three and hit enter. At this point, we can power off our iStat and it will upload into our electronic health record.